So this is a quick and dirty video on how to install a new string on a Bigsby trim. Seems like <clears throat> this has become a, a challenging task for a lot of people. So I'm gonna just show you how the easy, easy way to do it. It really helps if you have a capo and a string winding attachment and or a string winder. Um, either one works, I, I have both. Uh, <clears throat> so the first thing you do, obviously take the strings off. I have this, this completely restrung already. This is the last string I, I'm gonna leave. I use the E string because it's the largest so you can see it in the light. What I've done here is I've made a little, a little bend, a little crook in the string. Not, and you don't wanna bend it so that there's an angle you just want to have a nice light bend on there. Strings are pretty tough because you're going to bend them, so they're kind of meant to do that. You just want to hook it like that, okay? Second of all, <clears throat> I'm going to feed it into the eyelet. I'm just going to leave that tag in there, okay? And in the meantime, I'm going to feed that under the into the trim and I'll get it up. It helps if you, I've done this quite a few few times, so I'm pretty proficient at it, but it, you know, it, if you have big hands, it could, it could probably serve to be a, a, a challenging, but anyway, you take your, <clears throat> you take your little, you feed it under, your string under your little bar here, your little retention bar, and then you feed it around, and that's why this little hook comes in. You just want to hook it and just feed it right in there and just catch it right on there. If it's straight and the string is, you'll never get it. it but, so you set yourself up for success and that's it. And then when, from there, what I do <clears throat> is once it's on, right there, I get it, you know, kind of where I want it. Then I secure my capo just on that string, just to hold it in place. And then I usually go back about a fret and I start my winder. And I do a, a pinch knot, poor man's um, lock and tuners. Once everything's in place, I can take my capo off and it stays where I need it and stretch my string. I just use a screwdriver handle, smooth screwdriver handle. Just give it a, not too hard. Just enough, you'll know when you're, you can see the clear difference in your, and then you wind it up. And I'll clip all these tags off. But that's, that's how you string, set your Bigsby. That's the easiest way to do it. You just make that little loop. Thanks for watching.